So hi and welcome back to my No Torches run of Darkest Dungeon. And last time we did a level 3 boss. Uh, it was the 12 pounder I think. And the cannon. Sounds like a hamburger or something. The 12 pounder. Quite a big <laughs> hamburger. But anyway, uh, we destroyed that one. Which means that uh, my low level party should have no stress, no problem in uh, doing a new quest. And I'm thinking about doing uh, the last of the bosses at level 1, the Sonorous Prophet. It's in the ruins. Uh, I don't have any uh, crusaders, but I think we will manage anyway. So I remember that I uh, co uh, complain a bit about uh, Baldry's camping skills uh, because there are not really any buffs. So I will give him, give her bless because that will increase the accuracy and dodge on one companion, and I will also try to remember to activate it like that. So that was one thing I should do. I have also this new recruit. I guess I should give her some better camping skills as well. Something like that. Oh, I have actually not uh, given her any skills at all. Okay. Let's just go with everything again. And uh, my men at arms can have some new gear and some new skills as well, I uh, would guess. Yeah. Not even looking what they. how much better he will get, but. Hmm. It's interesting that he can stand in the back row and buff people. That's quite interesting. It's really a weak buff, I mean, 7 accuracy. That's not a whole lot. Hmm. But yeah. Ah, oh, well, that's fine. Oh, and we can also upgrade uh, our leper. Um, oh, well. I'm thinking about uh, how does Intimidate uh, compare to Hue, so Intimidate has higher accuracy but lower damage and lower crit as well, but it has a debuff, really nice debuff, so it's not a bad skill to have uh, active. Hmm, yep. Let's just give him some weapons as well. Like so. And go to the sanitarium. Uh, let's remove Nervous from Fitzherbert. This mass. Uh, let's remove Bloodthirsty. Duval, do you have anything we should remove? Yeah, Sophobia. Nomad wagon really quick. I would like this leper mask, but I don't like the minus 30% healing received. So we'll actually not bother with it. Oh, by the way, I should also see if I can give my leper some uh, camping skills. I mean, this one is pretty nice. 10 accuracy. So let's go with that one. Okay, enough yapping. Let's create our party and let's go. So we have a leper and a man at arms. Let's have them go around like that. Or not, let's have them like so. Uh, we have our healer and then our new. Arbalest. And since I know that these two, two items worked good on my 
other Orbalest. I will use the same ones in my new one. So let's try to buff her up as well. Like so. Otherwise I think we have decent enough items. Hmm, we could give uh, our man at arms one more item. But it takes so much time because I don't really know which items that are which. It's so hard to see or remember. Give him more max HP, is that a good idea? Oh well, let's do it. Yeah, Sonorous Prophet, let's go! I think we have ev everything we need. I will bring a lot of food as usual because I'm a wuss. Uh, I wonder if he use any negative things. Sounds more that he has stress attacks if he's a kind of a prophet. So. Oh well. Mm, let's go. Excavations beneath the manor were well underway when a particularly ragged indigent arrived in the hamlet. This filthy, toothless miscreant boasted an uncanny knowledge of my ambitions and prognosticated publicly that left unchecked. I would soon unleash doom upon the world. One might think that uh, the guy, the narr narrator, is the main villain in this game. Huddled together, furtive and vulnerable, rats in a maze. At least it feels like so. So let's go with the uh, marching plan because plus two speed is really useful as well as uh, reswing the crossbow giving a lot of damage six more um, can give more buff to one companion so let's give her even more of a buff then we have three, three more time units accuracy and do dodge or Giving him himself accuracy and reduces stress. Or the man at arms can get this buff. Oh, this is much better, I think. So everyone is pretty buffed up right now. So should be fine to fight the boss, I hope. Let's not get ambushed. Okay, so I guess the boss should be in this room as far away as possible. So I had to think about if I should uh, dim the light or not. It's such a long way, so I think I would go with uh, lights on because. I want to kill the boss. I'm not really concerned about uh, the loot right now. I'm kind of tired of uh, doing these level 1 dungeons over and over again. So, And the scouting information is a really nice buff as well or perk. Yeah, we will have a fight here and then one in this room. So let's see what it is. So this is a rather nasty group. Hopefully we will have the speed to kill one of these before they attack us. One damage? How how did that happen? <laughs> I'm not sure. Let's just re-heal a bit. I can try this intim intimidating attack now. See if we debuff them. No, both of them resisted. But he missed anyways, so... Let's go with the Retribution on the ranged guy. And uh, let's...
it rains on death with suppressing fire. That debuff landed at least. So. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. This uh, repost is a little bit strange to use in the way that I mean if he if he move last the man at arms if he move last it's and then he moves first the next turn advantage. then he will Give not have no the quarter. chance to do any uh, retaliation at all okay I have to move back I'm not sure if I needed any heals, but let's try to stun him. Yeah, he got uh, <laughs> outmaneuvered. He got perma stunned. Okay. And I should bring my uh, leper to the front again because the man at arms has this rampart, the stunning skill, that will move him forward one tile when he uses it. So. If he gets knocked back one row, he can still use the stun, I think. Yeah, he can use the stun and then he will move forward. So that's a really nice way to counteract any kind of surprises or if you get uh, pushed back or something like that. Right. Should I try to... I should try to kill one of these, I think. Yeah, let's go for the Bone Soldier. Only 4 damage. Yeah. Let's try to kill one of these ranged guys. Slow and steady wins the race. You um, can use Blind Fire, I think. Oh, I don't have blind fire activated. Well struck. That's a good crit. Wonder if she does more damage with crits than other characters because it feels like she does so much. Let's try to do an intimidating blow. So we got debuffed. Try to stun him. Oh, now he moved forward, but that's okay. Uh, she can't even attack anyone in the front row like this. What a load of bull. Well, bandage the leper then. These nightmarish creatures can be felled, they can be beaten. It's a trap! It's a trap! Well, let's carry on. Get some heirlooms. Oh, and some medicine herbs as well. Now, the darkness holds Two of my guys got surprised, but not all Black of them. Death. I didn't know that that could happen. Let's kill one of these uh, weaker guys. We're not even bothered with retribution. Even if it's kind of fun. Be gone, fiend. Yeah, I had to I have to give her the ability to Executed shoot guys in the front row. Especially if um, the boss will be one of these. Uh, one of these guys that is in the front row, but uh, usually they are uh, bigger than one uh, square, so it might not be a problem. Oh, now we surprise them instead. Alright, start uh, shopping away then. doesn't have any AOE skills with this, which is a little bit uh, of a bummer. 
otherwise I think the Man at Arms is really, really, really useful. Let's go with Blind Fire to get some speed buffs. That way she should be able to kill one of these this turn anyway. It's a little bit of a high uh, damage variation from her skills, 6 to 14. Or up to 29 at least. Okay. Yeah, that was a nice fight. A trifling victory. Who has the most uh, bleed resistance of these guys? Whoa, yeah, well, you can notice that's for sure. 90%. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. That's a lot, I mean, 90% <laughs> bleed resists on level like 2, whatever he is. Should be a trap somewhere here, yeah there it is. It's a little bit uh, worse at dealing with traps, but he's still the best in the group, so yeah, he disarmed it alright. <laughs> I love that way. Just, uh, Walks into the trap. Damnation! Yeah. Let's do some fighting. I should have eaten first, but this group is mostly bleeds and stress. I could use the stress heal. Might not be a bad idea, really. Reducing some stress. Try to kill this uh, bony fellow. One bleed. Let's try to repost a bit. Mostly because I like that skill. I wonder how much crit I got from the sniper shot. It's only 5% uh, modifier. But that might not be that bad. Let's try to debuff these guys. I need a bandage. I think I have a bandage. But I think I will uh, save it for the leper. Since it makes the most sense. A singular strike. Yep. Some more stress resistance or stress lowered, which is always nice. Uh, so let's eat some food, and you should use a bandage. Holy water, what can I use that for? Not a whole lot, really. Ah, let's not bother with this. Uh, oh, I could have thrown away my torches. Oh well. Oh, I don't like these groups too much. Let's try to debuff the big guy. Nope, he resisted. Rain in the forest? Oh, it's because he <laughs> critted. I mean, what, what? What is he talking about? Rain in the forest? Yeah. Let's try to kill this cutthroat, and then it's just a blood letter left. I would like to have. Uh, Four man at arms and then use and, uh, retribution attack on every single one. Then, when they use an AV attack like that, then they will have four guys uh, retaliating at the same time. I think that would be quite funny. Perhaps that's just me. No more scouting. At least a bag of nothing. Oh, it was actually some money. Now my arbalest is disarming 
Yeah. Selling traps as well. Intent. Read the book, please. Dull and in uninteresting. I mean, did he just read a whole book while they was uh, adventuring? And he reads quite fast. Oh man, my guys are Ambush disarming traps <laughs> like crazy. Mm. Oops. Let's remove that one. Oh, another one of these. Ah, it cannot happen twice. Nope. We Tax got some money instead. Are often low on supplies. So, we might have a fight. Uh, but I will have to keep 8 food if I have to go all the way over here. If the boss is not here. Which he wasn't, so yeah. So, while we are backtracking, what should we do? Sing a song or something? Okay, we will have more fighting in this corridor. Please be an easy group with no stress. It would have been an easy group if we gotten didn't get surprised. Yeah, this will, this will actually be really, really dangerous I think let's try to debuff these guys both of them resisted oh at least the guy in the back cannot do anything it's good that he attacks my man at arms So let's use Ramper to make our guy go forward. Uh, let's use an AOE, AOE heal. Uh, try to kill a bone soldier. I will single target these guys. Now they are attacking my beefy guys. Okay. Some blind fire. I would like one more. Um, one more heal. Ah, well, let's not bother with it. As victories mount, so too will resist. Should I bring the emerald instead of something else? Let's remove this. I have one of these already. Okay, so... Um, yeah... Oh, yeah, sorry. I had to choose a new room to go to. It's really interesting that I've made this game. I, I mean, it's a good game. But it has such a simple mechanics and everything like that, but it's still a really good game. Which I find really interesting. So we'll have two more fights. That's a bit concerning. So let's have some easy fights. This should be easy if we don't get surprised again. Nice crit heal. We can use a re attack. Uh, nah, let's focus one down so the ranged guy gets in front of us. I don't want him to attack anyone in the back rows with his ranged attack. Let's try the retribution. the time to heal once more yes I will no crit this time though yeah that fight went pretty well 
their overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. But um, yeah, let's remove the citron then. Hmm. AOE attack time because it always crits. How it's how is the damage modifier on that one? It's minus eighty percent. I don't understand how it can do so much damage. Yeah, intimidate them. Try to stun him. Might work. Yeah. Hmm, I could reduce the stress. Hopefully we will be able to kill him before he acts anyway. Yeah. This expedition at least promises success. I should move you guys around a bit as well. The contents are yours. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Two more rooms. It has been some time since I cleared a whole dungeon. Hmm. Okay, they will do stress attacks. 20 stress, that's pretty much. I didn't get who did the attack, but... Uh, we could just kill this rabble, I think. Use the... Judgment to finish this guy off. Move to the front. Oh, he stabbed him in the chest. Okay, fire, fire damage. Okay, stress attack. Let's go with the sniper shot then. There's only one uh, soldier, bone soldier left now. I am tempted to keep him, him alive one turn. Because I'm cheap like that. Perfect. Some stress reduction as well. A key. Ah, I mean, it's like only one more room, so don't have to bother with any keys, I think. Some more stress. March, friends! Oh, I should move these guys around. Oops. Yeah. This is a bad position to be in. Some blind fire from the Arbalest in the front. thing is, now these two guys will just <laughs> change places all the time. Oh, but at least this guy can use some kind of protection, I think. Let's try to land this uh, hand of light. <laughs> so I can use uh, the pro defender buff on someone. Yes, it should be best on uh, the healer, like so. Yeah, look at this. He's being useful even in the back row. Oh, come on, one more HP. Hmm. 
not guard the range guy now then. Yeah, he's tanking like a boss. But uh, these stress levels are a bit dangerous if the boss will do stress attacks as well, then I'm in a bit of a trouble, I think. Intimidate them to kill one of them at least. Let's move for oh we could move two for two tiles. What kind of bogus is that? Come on, stop pushing him. Well that was really crazy that he could move two tiles forward. I mean yeah sure some of you guys can do that, but you don't think that the uh, the most heavily armored guy should be able to move around like uh, some kind of uh, finding the stuff is only the first bolt. test. Uh, now it must be carried home. Let's try a uh, shovel. Nope. Hidden treasure. Okay, so we should go like this. Uh, let's hope there is no more battles. There's a secret bag. Okay, let's eat our last food. Nice, a crit heal. Oh, it's so tasty! Uh, it's not anything else I can do right now. Nope. Let's go for it. Right. Hmm, I see crumbling earth, stone and blood. So I guess something bad will happen in these two slots. Man, look at these barricades. Oh well, let's just uh, whack away at them. At least they don't have any any kind of protection. So if I use the rampart now to move forward, will I still be hit by this, or is it my leopard that will get hit? Let's try it. Nope, it's still landing on him. I have to mark this guy. You will be shooting a lot of sniper rifles or sniper shots. Light. Whoa, boy. At the very precipice of oblivion. How are you supposed to deal with that? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. But one thing is clear, if you are going to do this, you kind of need to bring some off healers to be able to deal with that, I think. And you should not bring a lot of these uh, <laughs> melee guys, that's for sure. Not sure that uh, I will benefit from doing a single target heal on... Uh, on her. Hmm. Because I guess that this uh, rock will kill her anyway. So let's go with the party heal to get some healing on the other guys as well. Okay, death store again. So I could move, but I can only move backwards, okay. 
Well done, let's not move backwards, let's gamble for quit. You will most likely die now. But yeah, I'm not sure how to deal with that. Come on. Try to destroy this one, I guess, so I could uh, use the protection. Not sure it will help that much. Uh, let's go with the retribution skill. Okay, now we got stunned, so he cannot retaliate. Should also bring a lot of anti venom to this fight. <laughs> Death Store again. Come on, a crit again. Oh, five damage. And now the true test. Hold fast. Another Death Store. Let's destroy this barricade. No, my healer. Now I'm in deep trouble. Such a terrible assault cannot be left on And soon my um Oh, it's not marked anymore. Oh well. That's why my sniper shot isn't really working that good. Only two guys left. Well, at least he only hits one with this. Mm, let's go with the repost again. Injury and despondence. Okay, he's soon dead at least. Only seven more. wasn't a clean fight, not a clean fight at all. Not sure how to deal with it. And these guys are still uh, <laughs> role playing. Yeah, destroy that barricade. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. So. Or in blood. Oh, we got the uh, items from uh, from our fallen comrades. So. I should just remove everything I don't need. I think the legendary bracers is good to have. I think the emerald should go as well. Kinda like this one. For my healers. Uh, Steady bracers isn't that uh, useful I think. I guess the quests are not worth that much. Uh, let's go with something like this. Yeah. Or not. Let's go like that. Yeah, that's better. So that wasn't a clean kill, but uh, we did it. I'm uh, really curious about that. I mean, I, I thought I would uh, be able to not get hit by and moving the guy that got the stones on top of him but it uh, obviously didn't work so yeah some negative quirks? no, it's actually a good one so th this guy actually has a lot of accuracy buffs which is really really useful on the uh, leper he's like never missing oh and the uh, Freeman has a lot of these nice quirks as well yeah, it wasn't perfect. Was lord of this place. Really not perfect. Before the crows and rats made it their domain. 
but it worked out anyway. We will have to recruit some new uh, additional guys if you would like to. I mean, it doesn't really matter now that I have killed all the level 1 heroes. I don't need new low level heroes right now. So we can continue on with the higher level versions in the next episode. But uh, thanks you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.